Women's brains are in their feelings and uh, they often think ahead, but they don't see the big picture. Women can think ahead and they're always looking to see ways where they can hurt a man and, uh, and, and you know, what means the most to the man. Because if a person know what means the most to you, then they can always try to take that away from you or stop you from getting that. And they feel like that'll hurt you the most because it means the most to you or you got a spot in your heart. But I'm here to tell you that you got to guard your heart. You know, you have to guard your heart. Because women, they only living in the moment. They drinking. They want to look good, but they drinking. They're using so many chemicals on their face and in their body and they're kissing so many different guys and doing so many different sexual activities with women and men. Um, they're all over the place. They live in multiple type of lifestyles. And uh, they eating all kinds of food. They're trying all different types of food all over the world and they kissing and they, they exchanging molecules and bodily fluids with all types of people all over the world. You know, and this DNA is something strong. And it's teleguarding and this stuff is coming out of their skin. It's, it's, in, it's storing in their brain and all these different demons and generational curses that these people have all over the world and Pookie and Ray Ray, the hood. They dealing with the hood molecules, the bougie molecules, the strange molecules. They just having this that they living in the moment. And they want to look good, but they don't understand their lifestyle is causing them to age rapidly. Kissing is a very, very nasty and a very dangerous thing to do. Kissing. The danger of kissing is serious. And I'm, I might make a separate video on that, but I took a DNA test and all they needed was spit. They told me everything that was in my body accurately. I have family members that have different names and they would never know that these people are in my family that took the test. And those people names came up that they in my family. They, you would, they would never know, because these some of them, some of these family members have different names and change their names and some more stuff. But they know because of DNA from spit. They can tell you everything about your whole genetic makeup from spit. So you know they can cure that. You know what? If they wanted to, but that's another story. Um, yeah, so they doing all this stuff and it's going to, the big picture is they're going to have telegoning, they're going to get a lot of vaginal diseases, the baby going to have different DNA, even if it's one man egg, the baby going to have different DNA from the telegoning, from all the other DNA, from all the other guys that they've been smashing. The chemicals on their face from the makeup and stuff is going to cause, it, it, it can cause or activate cancer cells in their body. It's going to mess their skin up, clog their pores up. Dealing with all these different guys is going to make, it's going to break their libido, lower their sex drive, and loosen up their, loosen up their, their, their and, and, and ball the grip off their tires and loosen up their hole. You know, so they're getting so much, their tires are getting so many miles from all of the lifestyle, all the different parties, all the different guys, that all the grip is getting ran off. Okay, they can do surgery and this and that, but eventually there's a breaking point with no return. No matter how many surgeries you get, eventually something, if it's broke, it's broke. They only get one of them in this lifetime. But unfortunately, the devil wants them to miss out on giving the best years of their life to a good man that love them, that's of God, where they can live a peaceful and helpful and healthy lifestyle. They're not down with that. They want a hot girl summer with the devil and smashing different guys, three to four guys a month, 
exchanging all kind of molecules and DNA. And if you guys join that party, be prepared for the demons as well. And you will have to go to the altar too, my brother. And pray that those dark forces get out your soul and your brain. And demons storing. And they, they did a research and showed demons storing in different parts of the brain. Unexplained activity taking taking over the brain, like as they saying that they show they show on a diagram that you know something is trying to alter the brain, alter the the, the process of the brain. Those are demons resting in certain parts of your brain, you know your soul and different and connecting to your brain, trying to you know every now and then you something pop, you hear something pop, you feel better. That's a demon that popped out just your head because you couldn't, it probably couldn't control you. You wasn't weak. You didn't even know a demon was trying to get in your head. But you were so, maybe you're just a strong person or you, you wasn't, he wasn't able to, the demon wasn't able to use you in any way possible. And then it had to go out. It had to jump out of you and try to find a better host. Hey folks, this, you say what you want. It's my job to let you know that if you don't know, now you know. And if you don't know, then you know that the demonic world is real. The spiritual world is real. It's even atheists starting to see that. They scientifically can prove the spiritual world now. So it ain't no, oh, is it? Yes, the spiritual world is more real than this physical world. Because the spiritual world made the physical world. Man, y'all got to get down with the program. Anyway, women are, they can't see the big picture. They don't see that eventually their, their lifestyle, they're already aging faster than men. And their lifestyle is going to make them look worse when they're trying to look better. And their baby is going to come out with all, the different, all these different DNAs from all these different guys. Ah. Oh. They got to watch that behavior. But they're not kid because they're only living in the moment. And they're getting controlled by their feelings. And the devil is working through their feelings. So they're getting controlled by the devil. So it, it runs deep, y'all. It really runs deep. And the big picture is that they're going to ruin their life, waste their time, miss out on true love, miss out on kids or just having a family. They, many of them might get babies. But they're missing out on love, the family experience, and the fight for Jesus Christ to help protect souls from choosing the devil and introducing souls to Jesus Christ the, the right way if they haven't already, um, you know, if they haven't already got to know Jesus. I'm Alan Rainey. Everything you need is in the description box. You want me to interview you, message me on Instagram. The Instagram link is in the description box. Everything you need is in the description box. My songs, my albums, my books. Everything you need is in the description box. Patreon, you want to join the Patreon and support the channel, you can. Um, everything, make sure you press like. Uh, if you want a consultation with me, you want me to talk about something that you're going through in your life, you want my opinion on something that's going, that you're experiencing or going through in your family, friends, relationships, finances, insecurities, or you think somebody cheating, you're trying to know how you, whatever you want my opinion on, um, let me know how much time you want in, in the Instagram. And, uh, and um, make sure you have Cash App or, Z or PayPal. I don't do Zelly. Cash App or PayPal only, and uh, we can do that. Um, if you want me to interview you, let me know. You want me to interview you for like seven minutes, and I'm gonna post it on YouTube. All right, I'm trying to get more technological thing. I'm how to. Um, if any of you guys know how I can um, record the screen, record my screen, let me know. I could research. I'm so busy, y'all. Don't. That's why most of the time I make these videos. I look tired. I look well rested today. You can see the vibrancy, the strength, the youth. But most of the time, I don't, I don't really get too much sleep as much as I would need to. But I'm well rested now. That's why I look so handsome and bright and vibrant. So humble, right? Um, but if you, any of you guys know how to um, 
how I can easy way for me to record my screen. Um, let me know so so I can when I put the videos on uh, that my interviews on YouTube, they'll come out um, more clear and more better. I'm Alan Ray and stay prayed up in Jesus' name. All right, I'm out. Pookie, Ray, Ray. He pookie, I'm Ray, Ray. He pookie, I'm Ray, Ray.